PDF for the uh, ePacket ship label. You can see um, this is the ePacket uh, shipping label. It's made by the small sensitive papers. So on this way, uh, we just printed the label by the printers and uh, uh, we can very easily to use it on the package. Uh, okay, let's go ahead and uh, to check uh, how uh, the extraction of the e-packet labels. Um, you can see this is the labels that for e-packet are shipped to uh, United States. Uh, now, F is, uh, is a code uh, on e-packet that is shipped to a uh, United States. You can see the e-packet is uh, in instructed uh, combined by China Post and the United States Post Service, which is means the e-packet when the parcel in China is shipped by China Post, when it's out of China and uh, is used by United States Post Service. So the e-packet is one of the combination between China Post and the United States Post Service. Okay, and. Uh, here is the I mail post paid China post, which means the parcel is paid by China in China. So that means you guys need to pay our uh, the shipping first, and we pay the post office, and uh, everything need to be paid advance so the parcels can be uh, shipped. Okay, here two A is a code of the different. Uh, strict zone in the United States to a uh, which is uh, a little bit far away from some place in the United States uh, there are different district zone uh, when the person uh, see a delivery to in United States to a uh, it's it also means the shipping time will take a longer time than you uh, than the normal ones, and I will show you the other one, which is uh, maybe two R and some other, which will be faster than than these uh, district district zone in United States. Okay, here is the e packet um, logos. Uh, it's a TM brand. You can see. Okay, here is from you mean which means the parcel is from where? It's from China. You can see it's from the China Shanghai, and uh, the zip code is two zero one six double zero, and the Shanghai in China, and it's also is the um, uh it's uh Songjiang District and uh, Huping Road. Number uh, one eight eight eight, and uh, here is the uh, sender code. Uh, some customer asked me uh, if it's possible to change the sender address uh, to uh, their own address. Actually, we cannot do that because uh, you know the person when they ship from China, these these this address have to be unique. It cannot be uh, so many difference. Because the post office will, will know uh, which is the post office from. Actually, this is, is a post office address. It's not a vendor's address, so we cannot change it. Okay, so here you can see there's uh, some uh, also instruction, custom information available in touch C and, and 222. USPS personal scan bar below for delivery email information. Okay, okay, this is custom information available on Adash C. Actually, this is you can see here CN22, which is means the custom information. That means this is the like like term of the delivery the parcel. You can see I. The undersigned, undersigned whose names and address are given on the item certify the 
particulars given is in declarations and correct, and that this item doesn't contain any dangerous articles or articles prohibited by legislations or by post or custom regulation. So this is actually like a security terms. So that means we cannot ship some products that contain some dangerous, which is contain some powders. Actually, just uh, the custom will consider it's like a drug. Uh, we cannot ship some uh, uh, powders and uh, some a uh, lot of uh, other commodity products. Actually, it's which is looks alike a danger for us. So that cannot uh, get approved for the person when it's uh, go go us through the uh, security inspection machine. So we can on this person you can see we can only ship the regular products. Okay. Okay. Here is the uh, address for the uh, receivers. You can see two from. Okay. Um. This. This uh, is the telephone number, and uh, actually this tel telephone number is not uh, uh, it's not uh, required actually. It's because it's shipped by China Post. Okay, it's like uh, I, or United States uh, Post Service, USPS. This is not required because it's shipped like a mail. The person will deliver it to them uh, receive as mailbox, so it, the telephone number is not required. Okay, this is the shipping to United States, and uh, you can see this the uh, state. Okay, here's the zip code. You can see here's also zip code. When shipping a parcel, the shipping uh, the zip code is very important. This is very uh, difficult for uh, very important when the parcel. To uh, to send to different districts. If this per this the zip code is incorrect, maybe the person will uh failed to deliver it. Okay, okay. So this is the city and this is street. This is the receiver lane. Okay. Uh, here's a track number. We also use this barcode, and uh, you can see here's a track number. The United the the packet track number is start from L and end up with uh, CN. CN means in ship to China. Okay, L actually is, looks like uh, the packet. All the packet uh, ship to uh, United States. Or actually, all the e packet shipping method are start from L and end up with CN. That means ship from China, okay. Okay, this uh also nine uh nine uh figures in between the uh the later, okay. Uh, this the actual uh, like what I thought the packets are the shipping level are combined two different. Uh, different sheet side. You can see the that one is front side. This is the back side. Okay. We also the same same tracking number. You can see and also the same same ship uh sender address. Also the sender uh, mobile number. Actually, this is the uh post office contact number. This this is not our number and we cannot change it. Okay. So you can uh, take care. It's not. It's not a. It's very. It's not important. Uh, case to use this number. It's okay because customer will not contact. Uh, on this, this cannot get through from uh, other country. Okay. Oh. Okay. This also. Uh, important. This other person may be open officer or place French English. Okay. This means uh the parcel sometimes will be opened by the custom for the inspection. Okay, security inspection. Fee. Uh, actually, this is not. Uh, we don't charge fee. Okay. It's also the receiver address, like the 
uh, in front in front uh, side. Okay, this is the uh, declarations for the persons that can tell custom what is inside. You can see this is the item number. Item number. Uh, that means this this person owning one per product, which is the mobile phone sales sales. Okay, and this is two two pieces two pieces. Uh, this is the um, screw of the each of uh, the products, which is uh, will be confirmed before our uh, before our corporations and uh, before you send in orders. We need to confirm the SKU number. Okay, this uh, is very important uh, for customer, for you guys, and for our team, for our packing team. Okay, and uh, this is the kilogram. Maybe this. This we also use the uh, fixed figure because this is not important. Uh, every e packet person cannot be over over than two kilograms. So this we also can declare a lower of our gram because uh, uh, we we write on the person the uh, that's not important because it. It the actual actual weight will be uh will be confirmed that when the person reach the post office in China. So this is doesn't make sense. Okay, this is the value. Okay, some customer asks also ask why we write a lower value on the per on the labels. That's because we need to uh make sure this person just like a gift or some. Uh, samples, so the value can be very low, very low, so that we can avoid the tax. Okay, so actually this is maybe you products maybe um uh one hundred dollars maybe uh, something like that, but also we also declare very low, maybe ten dollars. That is because we send it like a gift. Different country have different. Custom policies. That means the tax is different levels and uh, and um, limit. So we also uh, declare lower value so that the shippings the the custom will not charge you a customer the uh, tax. So this is makes sense. We need to declare it as low as possible. That's not uh, maybe not the same as the actual price you sell okay so if customer asking you why the value is low you can ask you can explain like this way we help him or her to avoid the custom tax okay okay this is goods originals it's from china it's like cn okay uh just like here is the uh, security terms which is i have already already mentioned the uh, before, so this is uh the identify identification number of this is custom term in China is C N twenty two. Okay, this is also required. Send the signature or that signed. This is not make sense with custom because the post office will do that. Okay, so those two two labels are telling uh what is the e package. The uh, shipping label looks like okay. Uh, now I'm telling you how to attack the tracking numbers. Okay, normally we use the the site uh, uh, one seven tracking late to tracking numbers. Okay, this is uh, widely used in China or all the world. It's this site can be can track any kinds of uh, shipping methods. DHL, FedEx, TND, and any other commercial express also can be tracked. And the packet China Post and other fresh shipping is available tracking here. And uh, we also use these for all the world tracking and uh, use USPS.com to track the e packet that ship to United States. 
please note that the USPS.com is only available the uh, parcel ship to United States while you pack it. Okay. Once the parcel is shipped to other countries, it cannot be tracked on USPS.com. Okay. Uh, now I'm I'm making test and you can see how we track it. Okay. Uh, you see it is 2F, which is will be means this this parcel will take a longer time to deliver. It, okay. Uh, I check a copy and uh, pass the tracking number here. You can see. Okay, we don't we need to contact the blind. I will select the blind on the tracking number and track. You see. Okay, this parcel is I've been delivered in uh, 14 days. You see. Okay, the average tracking information are here. You can see. Uh, okay, from uh, in the next videos, we I will tell you some parcel will be delayed and why the tracking number is frozen there and without any moving. Um, that's because the parcel has left left the China and when the parcel is United States, the custom or the airport custom. Uh, post office to build this and to crowd the parcel, so that will delay. And the tracking when information once it's a uh, stop it, that means the parcel is in stock. We need to wait. Uh, okay, so you can see this parcel delivering a 14 days. Okay, 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 and check another one. Uh, I need to check. You can see. This or uh, United States F United States. You see F United States. You see this is Australia AU as Australia. You see also from China. It's different. Okay, it's Thai packet. It's China post, but it's not USPS dot dot com anymore. You can see it's not U United States post service anymore. You can see. Okay, this also district zone. Okay, this is one, one that means very quick to deliver it. And this is the a local uh, Australia, Australia uh, post office logo. Okay, okay, this is the post e press in United States, uh, Australia. Okay, this is different. You can see, or oh, but uh, it's not important here. Okay, okay, uh, let's check this track number. Also, try copy and paste. Okay, okay this part is also delivered in uh, 14 days. Okay, this is delivered to uh, Australia. You can see the parcel doesn't show up uh, when it's delivery, but at the finally it's delivery. There is an, there's no English track information. Okay. So you see this track number it can only track it on one seven track the net cannot be tracking United United State Post Service dot com you can see because as I said USPS dot com is only available if cut packet that ship to US UA United States. When you try to enter this track number is not available, I think. Okay, you see status not available, but it's a lot available here. Okay, so you will know e pack is not only you, you to United States Post Office. When ship is shipped to another country, that means we cannot track use USPS to come track it anymore. Okay, this is also trainer. Uh, same same means there's also trainer. Okay, okay, this is F means. Okay, you can see. It's two R is different. Uh, this is two in uh, zone in uh, United States. I think this parcel will be delivery very quick. Okay, uh, let's check it. Okay. Okay. Also track it on here. Okay. You see. It's delivery only nine days. Okay, it's very quick. Okay, uh, so you will see 
when you use the one seven track on it, you can uh you can you can get the information how long it take to the person that deliver it. Okay, so that is uh uh one seven track on it can can do. Okay. Okay, you can see this is four F. Okay, let's check it, and uh, you will see this tracking will be a little bit of delay and maybe take longer than uh, nine days. Okay. Okay, you see it's thirteen days. It's longer. Because it's different, different zone in United uh, District zone in United States, so we take a long time. Okay, so our our average delivery time is uh seven to uh fourteen days. Okay, sometimes we we'll maybe take only four days to deliver it to United States. Yes, it's happened. Okay, uh. Mm, please believe it. And uh, sometimes will be take longer, maybe uh or almost one month. I think mm, when it's a uh, ship to or uh, take around one month, this this is this this June have to uh, end up with F. Okay, maybe five F and something like that. Okay, so you will see. Okay, this is another man he pack it. Okay. Everything is, is um, almost the same, okay. So for this order, you can you have to also track it on one seven, uh, track it later, okay. Uh, you see, okay, cool. It's only six days to Netherlands. It's very cool, right? Uh, okay, let's keep on. Uh, okay. This is three R, okay. Also, a different zone. Okay, let's check it. How long it will take? Let's check. Okay, cool. It's also uh six days. You see. So that's also because we use uh, uh, e packet and uh, the district zone is also end up with uh, uh, with uh, r r you see r okay we we cannot mm, the we cannot to mm, define which is the code it should be but this also uh, have been recorded in the uh, post office system, so we cannot uh, define it by ourselves. Okay, so that is the uh, e packet shipping level and uh, the tracking site. Uh, I recommend you guys to use one seven track on it, and you can change the language to English. Okay, uh, if once the order ship to United States, you can use this one to USBS.com. You see. Let's check it here. Okay, you see it's delivered, and uh, okay, there is not, uh, there is not. How long time is uh the date of how long time is delivered? Okay, but it's contract on on this site you see, uh USBS.com. Okay, when the parcel you ship to United States only United States and then while you pack it. Okay, so maybe you asking how many countries that are available with e packet. Okay, here is our site. You can see, uh you can uh, scroll down. And here is the shipping price and delivery time. Okay. Okay. There here you can see um, we can available with the almost uh, thirteen three countries that are available. Uh, uh, thirteen four. Okay. 
United countries, you can see here. And that's Canada, Uni United Kingdom, France, Germany, Russia, Australia, Spraza, Saudi Arabia, Norway, and next one uh, Israel, Ukraine, Spain, more Malaysia, Denmark, Bel Belgium, South Korea, and uh, Poland, Sweden, Turkey, Finland, Ireland, Portugal, Joe, Japan, U U Italy, Hungary, Netherlands, Mexico, United States, uh, Hong Kong, Spain, Singapore, New Zealand, Switzerland, Austria. You can see uh, this 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. You see, it's, uh, it's double. You see, it's 13, 4 countries that are available with e-parking now. And the shipping price actually is some difference. You know, the shipping, this, this is, this shipping actually, this is for uh, different methods you need to add for, for different methods. Uh, except the shipping, because the shipping actually is a uh, higher way than here. And here, at least the shipping price is only for actually like a reduced fee. Know, register fee when you use a different. So when you create the uh on quantities, they also uh the keep it the same. That is because we uh, we already add the, the the shipping of the parcel by weight. You know, so no matter no matter how weight, uh, how many quantity of the parcel you want, the weight. Items weight will be increased, so the price we quoted you, the basic price we quoted you is include the products, the FOB price for the products, and the, the weight of the shipping cost. So the that is the okay. Uh, okay, you can see here how the shipping price is is a combination. Okay, this is the weight. Wait, and plus the uh, mm, FOB price of the products, okay, price of the price, products, also increase the register fee. fee. The register fee is means the different, the different shipping methods. So here it's like a package shipping method. This is looks like uh, as consider they consider it as a uh, registry fee actually. So uh, the weight of the shipping actually have been calculated already because uh, when we cut your price, we all, we have to check how man, how much weight this products, and uh, we call, we will add the shipping of the correspond uh, weight of these products. So uh, this is the, okay, this is our quotation. Okay. Okay, that is the uh, e-packet shipping, how is the e-packet shipping labels looks like and uh, what is the, uh, how to track it, okay. How to track the impact and uh, also uh, how we calculate the price. Okay, this is only for impact for this video and the, uh, in next video videos I will uh, to let you know how how is the register pause time pause and uh, some other shipping methods. Okay, because I recommend you guys to use impact is fast and uh, economic and uh, very safe and very good and because track information and delivery information or also included uh, included sometimes it's a little bit higher than china post but you no know, china post sometimes will get person lost and uh, the tracking information doesn't shine up but if you use your package rv info tracking information will be available and uh, rv tracking for uh, the delivery status also shine up, so that is very good for you. Uh, 
after sales team, okay? Okay, thank you guys. This is all today's videos for for the package and uh, the package look label looks like and uh, how to track it and uh, how we calculate the quotation. Okay, thank you guys. Bye.